Have you ever seen one of these in public? This is an AED. My name is Greg Brockway. I am the safety officer for Salina Regional Health Center and we'll be talking further about these in the next segment. Greg, thank you so much for coming on the show. We're going to be talking about an AED. First of all, what is an AED and where can you find them throughout town? AED stands for Automatic External Defibrillator. And they are actually designed for the lay public. They're not like a defibrillator in a emergency room or anything like that. They're designed for the lay public to come in. It gives you step-by-step -step instructions on how to put it together, turn it on, and then it interprets the EKG rhythm and tells you whether it needs to be shocked or not. Where do you, where can you find these around town? They're placed in some of the churches. I think you're going to see them in all the schools. The federal buildings are all required to have them now, and I think probably Joint Commission is pushing to get them all in the hospital in any public areas. I understand the foundation has purchased some and are putting them in places. Why don't you talk about that? Yeah, they did. The foundation helped me out quite a little bit on that project. We end up getting 12. We've got cabinets. We're also going to put uh, Stop the Bleed kits in the cabinets as well. And uh, again, it's going to be centered around wherever the they have local access. Why don't you take us through the process of, of how to use one of the AEDs? Typically anymore, whenever somebody goes through basic life support CPR training, they've included this segment into that training. So uh, say for example, you come upon somebody that's laying down, they're unresponsive, they don't have a pulse, Normally, all you would be doing is CPR. Now you're going to holler for somebody to call 911 and ask them to go get an AED. Uh, at that point, you'll start regular CPR, BLS CPR. When whoever you send for the AED returns with the AED, you'll place the pads on where they're directed to go. You simply turn the AED on and it goes step by step audibly telling you what you're going to be doing. It, it's very simple. It can even tell you if your CPR is effective. It may say uh, deeper compressions. It may say faster. So it evaluates your CPR as well. Thank you so much for some great information. And thank you for watching. For more information, please visit srhc.com, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter.